Tomorrow morning, death row inmate Donald Grant is scheduled to die by lethal injection after the U.S. Supreme Court denied the final plea to spare his life. The 46-year-old convicted in the cold-blooded killings of two employees while he was robbing a La Quinta Inn back in 2001. Retired Midwest City Police Chief Brandon Claves calling it among the most heinous and gruesome cases he's ever worked. Grant's victims, 29-year-old Brenda McElyer and 43-year-old Felicia Suzette Smith. Both women were shot and stabbed. But tonight, Smith's widower says he's been left brokenhearted and infuriated once again after learning he won't be able to see justice carried out on the man who killed his wife. News 4's Kaitor K talked to him today. Kaitor. Suzette Smith's widower wants to see Donald Grant's execution tomorrow, but the Department of Correction tells News 4 he missed the deadline to sign up, but the widower says, as her husband, it's his right to attend. They didn't notify me, period. I was out of the loop. Herman Smith says the Oklahoma Department of Corrections never invited him to the execution of his late wife's killer. Suzette Smith was one of two women killed by Donald Grant at a Dell City hotel in 2001. He's set to be executed Thursday morning. But when Smith called DOC for the first time on Wednesday... They told me I was too late. I had to fill forms and all kind of paperwork out, which I was unaware of. He says he needs to see his wife's killer get executed. I... I never get over it. Very tragedy and it sticks with me. The State Department of Corrections tells News 4 that individuals who wish to attend executions have to register, and that, quote, no records indicate this individual ever registered to be included on this list of people who would be alerted of things like clemency hearings, execution information, etc. Per policy, witness registration closes 30 days prior to the scheduled date of execution. This individual did not meet that deadline. Smith calling this policy unfair, saying if he knew he had to sign up, he would have. Well, I hope they would know that some things people don't know, that it should be more inform information given to people in a situation like this. Smith is considering suing the Department of Corrections, and he says he'll be watching news coverage of Grant's execution on television.